Hello everyone, I am Tanya Martinez from Remax Real Estate Results. Um, I'm here to talk to you guys about five myths that I've been hearing from a few clients and um, I just recently saw an article on Realtor.com so I thought I would talk about it. But first, please make sure to subscribe and hit the like button so that more people can find this video. So the first myth I see is that right now is not a good time to sell. And if you guys know me from some of my past videos, I have been telling everyone that please, if you guys are thinking about selling, this is the time. Right now we're in a seller's market and it's been extremely hard to find homes in some price ranges. So if you guys are, if you guys have homes that you'd like to um, sell or upgrade a, into a bigger home, let's, let's sit down, let's talk so that way we can get your home on the market because honestly, it's a great time to sell. Uh, I've been talking to some people and um, been showing a few homes here and there. And really, sometimes for one house, there might be like seven or eight offers. And we're in Northwest Arkansas, so you guys kind of get the idea. I mean, there's not a lot of housing to begin with. So that's a lot of offers for a house in our area. There is a lot of buyer demand. So if you guys are thinking about selling your home, go ahead and list it now. It's a really great time to sell. The second myth that I've seen is that some people think that houses, house prices are actually going down when in fact they have been going up and steadily climbing. If uh, I pull up two reports one from this year to compare it to last year, house prices have actually increased because of the low in inventory and um, high buyer demand. So like I said guys, once again, if you guys are thinking about listing your home, let's go ahead and sell it. This is a great time and really I don't foresee properties, um, especially in certain price ranges, going down anytime soon. I only see them going up. It's because of that low inventory. So myth number three is that buyers are holding off on buying their own homes. In fact, I have seen the opposite here in Arkansas. I don't know every market and I can't comment on every market, but according to realtor.com, the pending the amount of homes pending is 44.3% in the month of May. So we were right in the middle of the pandemic, so really it's a great time to um, if you're thinking about buying, right now is the time to jump on it. Um, but make sure that if you are going to be looking at houses, you've got that pre-approval ready, um, that you guys are have been researching homes in that area that you want to buy, so you kind of understand what homes are selling for. And of course, ask your realtor on how they think the market is going and what they, um, of course, a realtor can't tell you what to offer, but they can give you suggestions. Um, so just make sure that you're following their advice, especially since they are the expert in that area. Um, so just make sure that you guys um, are informed, researched, and ready to buy with that pre-approval. Of course, another thing helping you buyers buy a new home are the super low interest rates. Interest rates have honestly not been this low in quite a while. So it's time to take advantage of those interest rates. Um, yes, house prices might be a little bit higher, but if you really think about it, that equity is just gonna keep increasing as the cost of living keeps increasing here. It is harder to get a loan because you have to have a higher credit score, but if you can get a home right now, I would recommend it with these super low interest rates. Myth number four, is that you can't see the homes in person. Honestly, guys, I just came back from showing a house in person, so I know that it's possible to go out there, see houses. You're still able um, to pick colors in person on a new construction, um, right? It still hasn't gotten to the point where we have to go uh, see all the houses through video. And I, um, and I know a lot of buyers don't like that because, you know, you can't capture everything on video. You have to be there in person, um, see the home, feel, feel it, to see if the vibe is right for you. Um, there's a lot of things that go into homes. But like I said before, a lot of agents are still showing homes. But make sure when you do go see a home that you guys are wearing your masks, any foot coverings, if the listing requires it. Um, I know that some of you guys may not believe in that stuff, 
but believe it or not, some sellers may get offended if you don't go, um, if you don't show up wearing a mask or foot covers on your shoes. So, and that could actually hurt you whenever you are making that offer on a home. So please make sure to let's not offend any sellers. Just wear the mask. I know it's uncomfortable, but it's only for a few minutes while you go inside and see the home. And always practice safety. Safety is first for your realtor, for the seller, and for you. So make sure that you guys are practicing safe practices. Okay guys, the last myth that Realtor.com has is that people are fleeing from cities into the suburbs. And according to them, that's only partly true. There was a 13% increase in views on homes that were in the suburbs, but honestly not everyone is moving to areas that like Northwest Arkansas. Um, but I have, in my personal experience, I have seen a lot of people moving in from big cities here into this area. Now, of course, now this is, this area is a little bit different because we have Walmart, J.B. Hunt, and Tyson. So all of them are bringing in people all the time. So it really just depends on your area. And depending on where you live at, um, some people might be moving away from your area, even though it is more um, like a suburb area. So just make sure to ask your realtor. Um, but like I said, in our case, we are always having a large influx of people moving in. And they're moving in from other suburbs and other cities um, across the nation. So uh, I can't really comment on that. All I can tell you is that a lot of my clients are moving from big cities into um into Northwest Arkansas. If you guys are thinking about moving into the Northwest Arkansas area or if you guys are from the Northwest Arkansas area, uh, feel free to send me a map form at TKM Realtor. Um, that's on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube, guys. Um, and if you guys like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and so that way I can give you guys more news about what's going on in Northwest Arkansas and more investing tips as a whole. I hope you guys are having a great day and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!